today I am making up some blackberry liquor. Um, we have an abundance of blackberries in the freezer. I found a few extra bags. I just don't want them to go to waste. Um, spring will be coming shortly and I want to make sure these get used up before it's blackberry season again. So, um, I've got a half gallon mason jar that I'm going to be using and we are just going to fill this up with our frozen berries. You can let these thaw out. It's your choice. You don't have to. They'll thaw in the jar. But I'm just going to fill this jar up to uh, right up to the top, kind of, with these berries. little bit more in there just so the jar is full if you don't have enough to fill a jar that's okay this can still be done there I'm gonna throw these back in the freezer and we'll make muffins with those all right so we've got our blackberries in the jar and now we're going to add this a half gallon so I'm going to add two cups of sugar so a pint mason jar is two cups so we're going to use that for a measure because I always have mason jars handy there we go so we are just going to add this right on top of our berries we're going to shake it a little bit Get it down in there. And we're going to shake it a little bit more. We want to get that as evenly down in there as we can. There's going to be some on the top, but that's okay. All right, so now we've got our sugar and our blackberries in our jar. We are going to add, I like to use 80 proof vodka. You can use a more heavy duty 100 proof or even absolute, um, but I like the 80 proof because I'm not much of a drinker and it doesn't take much for me, I'll tell you that. So we are just going to put this in and we're just going to cover the berries. That's all we're going to do. It's going to sink right down in there. You can see the little air bubbles. Get it right down in there. I want to fill this just so it's covering the berries. This takes a few minutes because the berries are frozen. If they weren't frozen it would go a little faster. You could stir it better. But let's see if we can move this around at all. There you can see it's starting to get down to the bottom. So we will open this one. One of those little air bubbles. It's filling up. There we go. Now it's working. All right, so we have just got our berries covered with the vodka. And the frozen berries are a little hard to move around. But if you stick your spoon down in there on the edge, you can kind of get it going. And this, we are going to let this be, this will thaw out overnight. Later today, it will be thawed out. It won't take a long time because you're keeping it in the house. So we, I'm just going to add a cover to this and we're going to put this in the um, food cabinet just where it doesn't get any sunlight. You want it to stay out of the sunlight and we're going to let this sit for four to six weeks. I like most of my stuff to sit for six weeks just because um, six weeks seems to be a good time for for me. and. I use these plastic tops so air can escape any gases or anything. It can escape without a big huge disaster. So if you tighten it up, 
just give it a little shake and tomorrow for a few days I will I will give this a stir and kind of smash the berries up once they are once they're unthawed I'll smash these berries up so it gets real good in there and then after the six weeks you're just gonna strain this through a berry strainer and I like to use some cheesecloth a couple layers of cheesecloth I use if you open this up and that way it holds all the seeds out you don't want to get those seeds in there so um, I like to use this cheesecloth and just strain it right out get all those juices in there and it is ready to go after that so after putting it together you want to wait six weeks before you drink it you want to strain it out and some people like it cold we keep it in the cabinet it's a it's got a nice blackberry flavor and I'm not a big drinker so um, I'll put some of this in small bottles and give it as gifts to my family and friends um, and keep a little for myself and at my house for company if we have any but that's it it's really that simple you've got your berries and sugar and alcohol if you like this video give us a thumbs up subscribe see you in the next video